HTJ.tax, the international tax firm for six, seven, and eight-figure investors and entrepreneurs who are living that international life. Are you ready? I am an American living outside of the U.S. My source of income is from U.S.-based companies for performing marketing consulting services. Do you recommend registering an LLC in my home state in the U.S. to protect my personal assets from being taken away in case I get sued? If so, will I need to pay state taxes and federal corporate tax on my earnings? So great question. And it's a smart question because you know, which is something that a lot of people misunderstand, right? That having an LLC is not a tax play. It's not a tax benefit. There's usually no benefit from a tax perspective of having an LLC. An, L an LLC in the U.S. is a limited liability company, and it does what it says. It limits your liability in the event that there's some sort of dispute or there's some sort of lawsuit, right? It's to protect you and to protect your assets from uh, any problems that may arise. So it's about asset protection, not tax optimization, generally speaking. If it is that you're performing the services outside of the US, then the question is, where are you performing those services, right? Because when you have a cross-border situation like that, remember we spoke earlier about management and control. So even if you were, let's hypothetically say that you were to form that LLC in the US, but you sit in Singapore, management and control is being exercised in Singapore. If you do it in Malaysia or Bali or Australia, or wherever it is, if management and control is being done domestically within those jurisdictions, even though the company is incorporated elsewhere, the local tax authority has the right to tax it as if it were local. So uh, in, you know, in coming up with what's the best tax strategy for you from a tax optimization perspective, as well as asset protection. We need to understand more about the business model, particularly where are you? And do you, have a, do, you do it all yourself as a marketing consultant or do you have a team? If so where's your team? But let's assume that you're a one-person show and you sit in London or let's say Singapore. So uh, I don't know where you are, anywhere, right? So then you'd probably want to speak to an advisor who understands both the US and domestic rules. But chances are they will probably say, you know what, you need to incorporate a company in Singapore, in London, in the UK, wherever it is you are. Now, if it is, I know, I know I have some clients that do that sort of work. And then the problem they have is that their clients in the U.S. like dealing with an LLC for a number of reasons, whatever. So then what you could perhaps discuss with your advisor is you form a company in wherever you are, like London or Singapore, to be compliant with local rules. But then that company that you form can have a subsidiary in the U.S. You can form an LLC. Uh, as a subsidiary of that, that, that company. So uh, you can have that type of conversation so that it, you, know, you get your asset protection, you get your tax optimization. You can, you, of course, there's compliance. You comply with local rules, which is important. You don't want to get kicked out of wherever you are. And then you, you, your clients feel happy and comfortable that they're dealing with a US LLC. So that, that's the sort of conversation I'd encourage you to have with your tax team. So if you're a six, seven, or eight-figure investor, entrepreneur, or business owner who needs a tailor-made solution from a qualified team of professionals, we can help you achieve the international lifestyle, the freedom, and even the tax savings you're looking for. Visit us at htj.tax and live that international life.